I'm actually almost out of ammo as well. If there's any round I'm going to go down and stay dead, it's this round. Screw it, gravity spikes. I literally have this many bullets left. Okay, don't have any quick revives left, but I could always... Oh god, yeah, I'm so dead. I mean, if I roll the right gobble gum, then I'm, like, safe. Wrong one. I don't care how expensive it is, but I'm not taking Pokeaholic right now. Am I going to have to give up this gun? Oh my god, that lost so many points. Alright, screw it, I'm giving up this gun. I'd rather give up this gun than give up this game. Oop. Christ. Uh, let's go get double tap. Let's make this like much better with double tap. Damn it, the pants is close as well. Right, screw it, let's go pack a punch this like right now. Maybe someone could provide more ammo. Yeah, I don't have a choice. I'm really I'm gonna have to pack <coughs> Really I'm gonna have to pack a punch this. Just have to be careful of the panzer. Your screams will be oh, come on. Desperate times, desperate measures. Okay, this isn't too bad. Right, hopefully I can get him stuck in that. Come on, just break the hell. Oh my god, yeah, I am probably not going to survive much longer. Especially with this panzer on my back.
round 50, I don't think. Right, so I'm just going to explain what's going on here because I've ran into a few problems when it comes up to this point. Basically, what's going on, uh, I'm going to pause in a second, I think. No, it's not. But basically what's happened is my computer sort of stopped recording properly, so I had to turn off my computer and turn it back on again and like restart my game capture. So at this point I've just started recording again, everything seems to be working fine, but I forgot to turn my mic on, which is really rather annoying because I don't remember what I said here, but I was just chatting away, you know? Talking about a whole bunch of random stuff. But, um, in fact, I only realised the mic wasn't working at the end of the game. So right now, I'm just sort of talking until we get to that point. Because, yeah, we're not too far off at this point. But this Panzer, Jesus Christ, I could not deal with him right now. Like, that's, that's the basic, basic gist of what's going on. I'm struggling to deal with the Panzer really struggling, running away, literally the only reason I picked up the Draken is because I thought it was like super strong and all, so I thought, hey, maybe I could actually use this to kill some of the guys, but no, this Panzer, I mean he dies now, thank god, but use that pain in my backside, like, ugh. So then I decided to do something stupid and continue doing the jar step, even though it's obvious that it is a pretty bad idea at this point. Uh, I kept trying to do the second tape for some reason. I didn't realise it at the time, but the markers weren't quite spawning in, so I went back here to throw the jar in. Thought maybe three in the ones, you know, all that jazz, and of course it worked. But I really shouldn't have done this, because, yeah, now I have three Marglers chasing after me, I have Dracon, which isn't doing too much at the moment, uh, a Pothican Servant that doesn't damage uh, Marglers at all, and Ragnarok, which I'm pretty sure I didn't even think to use at this point. But yeah, these are really powerful Marglers as well. And uh, it's getting close to the end game. The game's end. Yeah, it's getting close to the game's end. This bit I'm just sort of wittering on because I'm doing a voiceover, therefore it's easier to talk because I don't need to concentrate on uh, flicking my thumbs around. <laughs> Yeah, this is the part where everything goes death. So I'm going to cut back here, back over to my other self. Okay. Oh no, are you kidding me? My audio wasn't on that whole time. I was just talking away and it was off the whole time. I guess I'll talk over that. Two hours and 24 minutes. That's round about... The same length of Gora Krovi, but a million times the round. Ah, <laughs> oh, wow. It's been long. It's been very long. But I'm so glad that I'm actually out of there, because I was going... I, I knew I was going to die, because I didn't get that Keeper Step done soon enough. So it really was a case of... Um, Trying to do the keep of step on too high of a round for it to be worth it. I got five liquid divinions from that. And I went up four levels. Nice. Oh, wow. Oh, that was my first ever attempt. And that's the highest round I've ever been to on any map ever.
on on this game because I sort of went to a higher round on Black Ops 2 on Buried. But to some extent that one doesn't count because I actually cheated to get to that high round. But still, one poor garlic left. God, if I didn't have to lose the Thunder Gun and I didn't go down like during that particular step, there's a small chance that I could have. Uh, like if I didn't go down whilst fighting the Panzer, should I say, then there would have been a small chance of me doing... Ah, uh, oh, no, there's a perk like in slot 3. Small chance of me doing uh, at least to the second real ending. And then, and then who knows whether or not I would have got anywhere near collecting all the skull pieces. Oh my god. I just want a uh, near-death experience. That's the one I want. Near-death experience and shopping free. Because I've never had a shopping free. And near-death experience is so good for easter eggs with friends. This is actually the end. Christ, I love that map. But yeah, thanks for watching guys. <laughs> and, oh my god, I'll see you in another video. Jeez. Actually, before we go, let's look at my um, rounds overall. Highest round followed up by, like so, 48 on that my highest round ever to 42 on the giant, which was my highest round ever before, of course, Revelations. Uh, before my first attempt on Revelations, uh, and then 39 on the Rising Drac. I was actually playing with friends during that game though. I was playing with both Pedro and, uh, Ke like, the whole Are You Mesmerized, Kieran Sale, like, you know. And that was his first time playing Zombies pretty much since the game came out because of how much he really likes GTA V. He just couldn't be bothered with Black Ops 3 anymore either. So, yeah. And The Giant, I actually did that solo. Uh, Gorad Krovi, that was my first attempt. It's still my best round. Setsubo, solo. Shadows of Evil, solo. I think solo. Don't remember, but uh, let's see where I am on the leaderboard because, uh, like, for the map because it came out yesterday, so more people played it. So I'm in place two thousand. Now, if I got that round attempt yesterday, I actually would have been in the top uh, one hundred because I did look through the leaderboard because I couldn't play the map, but I could see the leaderboard. Uh, let's go all. If we go to top of the list, highest round is 155, then it sort of starts to jump down a bit. But the other day, the highest round was round 60. So, we get to below 100 at place. Oh my god, there are a lot of people who got to 100. There, there's only two people who have their highest rounds on round 99. And... So in between round 100 and round 98, there's only two people there. Oh, and that guy's got the uh, transit crew calling card. It's pretty interesting. Um, oh my god. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like in place 200, it was like 30, so I mean... Yeah, I did flick through the leaderboard a fair bit the other day. But yeah, thanks for watching guys, I really hope you've enjoyed, because I sure as hell know I have. Uh, I'm going to play this map like all the time now. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in another video. Goodbye.